Well, this is a classic situation when it comes to the golden silk orb weaver. I was riding my bike in the uh, trails of deep Florida here, and there's a bridge that goes across this slough. And uh, I talked before about the spiders building their nest across trails. And it's been a while since I took a face plant on one of them. But uh, it's actually so close that I can't film him with the other camera. I gotta use my cell phone. And that's actually where cell phones come in handy, handy sometimes. All right, where'd he go? I don't want to run into him again. There he is. So, I'm coming along here. And luckily I didn't get the part of the web with her in it. Now she's uh, over here. And you can see there's the trail blaze right there. And it's always difficult to shoot a spider because in the big scheme of things, there's this little little thing with all the background on it. That's her rebuilding her web on the trail. Oops, a little overexposed. I am holding my cell phone three inches away from the spider. She looks small because it's just a wide angle. Let's go on the other side. <clears throat> we'll duck underneath here. We'll duck underneath her web. Of course now I'm facing the sun. And you can see what it looks like from the other side. A little windy day, so... She's rocking and rolling. Whoa! <laughs> Almost blew right into my camera. <laughs> As I say, I'm like four inches away right now. See her doing her magnificent spinning of her golden web. You can get a little more of an angle so we're not looking so much into the sun. There we go. That's probably the best shot, best view I've had so far. Sort of a side view. She's that web is almost touching my left hand. You can see her going to town there. And you see that orange thing on the tree? That's the trail marker. And as I said in another video where I did a real long time lapse of a Golden Earl Weaver spinning the web. They love to spin webs across trails. So that orange trail marker and this... Whoa! She just touched my phone. They're sweet spiders. Really sweet. It's just a spider hanging in the middle of the forest about six feet off... Well, about, well she's about five feet off the ground. And uh, blowing in the wind. It's really, whoa! Really hard to... Uh, get a video of. And I feel bad about messing up her web because she's working away at it. What they do a lot of times is they stay off to the side of the trail on the main support and uh, the web is empty and then they wait for something to hit and then they run out and grab it. So I, luckily she wasn't in the web when I ran into it. I'd have her all over my face. But it's, you know, one of the, whoa, it's rocking out there now. She's feverishly working away. I love it that I got her. She's right there. And that's the trail. The orange blaze on the tree right there is the trail marker. Whoa! And the wind's going to blow right into my face. But they're the sweetest spiders. I wish... I think this is going to be a fair... There she goes. She's fairly in focus. And we got a little bit of sun on her now, so. Not the biggest spider you'll encounter in Florida. And they really mind their own bit. Whoa.
<laughs> uh, yeah. Not many spiders you can just stand here like my phone is literally right now three inches away. Whoa, one inch away. <laughs> the wind just blew into it. That is sweet. Sweet. So there's the tree with the orange blaze on it, and that's her. That's her web. And then this web is actually anchored over here. And right here is where a web comes across, and I duck underneath it and come out the other side. And now we're on the other side. Whoa! There's a hole in the trail there. Now we're on the other side right there. She probably wonders why I find her so fascinating. I love it when animals just sort of go about their business. Okay, we're ready to leave Mrs. Golden Silk Orb Weaver alone. There she is hanging with her web completely fixed from my giant bulbous head. And you can see that the web is right over the boardwalk and right next to the orange blaze. So. I said before, the best place to find a golden orb weaver is just walk through the jungle. Wait for one to hit you in the face. Backyard birding out. <laughs>